work with a sleep mask. So this is how I do my sleep mask. There are a variety of ways of making sleep mask, but uh, for me, maybe this is the easiest way. So make sure that you pull it tight. And now, uh, let's zoom on. I zoom in a little bit. Okay, too far away. Good. So now you're gonna make a chance. And start at the second stitch. So you want to skip the first. Okay. One single crochet. Two single crochet. And then chain three. One, two, three. So you gonna skip three stitch. Oh maybe three chains. And make one single crochet in the four stitch. So for the last one you're gonna make three single crochets in the same stitch. One, two, three. And you're gonna make five single crochet in the next five stitch. But here for the three middle stitch, I want to um, do three single crochet in the three chains, just for the prettier look. One single crochet and then for the last stitch of the row one you're gonna make increase make sure that you pull out the yarn so that you can see the stitch see that is the first stitch of round one so we're gonna make one single crochet and one more single crochet in the same stitch so for the round two and make sure that you have marker with you to mark where you end the round so here with the first we're gonna make one increase one single crochet and one more single crochet in the same stitch and now we're gonna do five single crochets in the next five stitches And for the corner, we're gonna make three increase. One, two, one, two, one. And then gonna make five single crochets in the next five stitches. And then for this, you're gonna make two increase one. Two, and then increase one more increase in the last stitch
Okay, and that is the end of the round two. So make sure that you mark the last stitch. And then for the third round, you gonna make one single crochet, one increase. Five single crochets in the next five stitches. And then make one, one single crochet and one increase three times. Okay, this is the increase. One single crochet. One increase. Okay, one more time. One single crochet. Increase. Five more single crochet in the next five stitches. And then make two times of one single crochet and one increase. Okay, here is the last seed increase. Okay, um, this is also the end of the round three. So we're gonna make round four. So from here, I don't likely to mark with the marker. I want to mark with like the Excess, excess yarn here to make sure like um, to make it easier to use to crochet in that stitch so now from round 4 to round 11 we're gonna make 28 single crochet no increase or no uh, decrease so make sure that you have um from four to eleven so now we gotta make the mouth um for round 12 we, you're gonna make 13 single crochets And then chain fourteen. Okay, fourteen chains, and then in the fifteen, the fifteen stitches, uh, you're gonna make one single crochet, like the last stitch of this uh, tw uh, twelfth round. Okay, for the next two rounds, the round 13 and 14, you're gonna make um, 28 single crochet. So here you not gonna crochet in the chains but like crochet each chains. Okay. Two. 
make sure you do it even and because you don't want to skip any gem So this is round 13 Oh sorry, we're gonna make two more rounds of 28 single crochet One, two, three, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, for the next row 16 You're gonna decrease We first decrease and then one single crochet, then five single crochet in the next five stitch. And then you're gonna make decrease and single crochet three times. Okay, next one with uh, 5 single crochets in the next 5 stitches And then gonna make um, the decrease and single crochets for 2 more times Okay. So the round you're gonna make a decrease and then five stitches uh five single crochet in the next five stitches. Then decrease three times one, two, and three. Okay, five more single crochet in the next five stitches. One, two, three, four. Okay, um, three more decrease. Okay, that's when we've done our main part is the body of the case. So then you um, just cut the yarn and hide it inside the body. But I just uh, do it real quick because nothing will show here. Make sure that you um, do it pretty well and close. Well, here you not want to close the hand. We will do it later with the hair. Okay, the next part, I'm gonna use this brown yarn, the darker brown, to make the, the mouth. So attach your yarn to the first, the first stitch here. And 
Okay, I passed your yarn here. Gen one and do one single crochet in that same stitch. So here I'm gonna want to hide my yarn while I'm crocheting. Okay, the first stitch. Okay, and then you're gonna make fourteen um, single crochet. And one more single crochet in the side of the mouth. So 14 here and one single crochet in the side, not included in that 14 stitches. Okay, so one single crochet to the side and then make more 14 stitches in the 14 chances. And make sure that you don't skip any stitches. Just count it while you make it. And do one more single crochet to the side of the mouth. The second, the second round, you're gonna make fourteen stitches and then make fourteen stitches. Oh, sorry, fourteen. Oh. Um, so here I'm, I'm not record the part I do the mouth, but here just I just increase the two side stitch. I'm gonna let oh sorry I'm gonna make some uh, title here. Like how to make it. Um, somewhere on the screen. So we're gonna do the decrease. Let's make fourteen stitches. Sorry, 14 single crochet. And then and then decrease two times one decrease two okay let's do 14 more single crochet in the next 14 stitches And then make two degrees. One. Two. So this is also the end of the mouth. We're gonna cut the yarn and hide it. You can hide it the outside because we're gonna roll inside out so let me hide it real quick So this is the how the mouth look like here. And you're gonna roll inside out. And it's really easy to roll and 
you maybe want to shove it a little bit okay like that so here this is the finished look of oh okay for the leg we're gonna make a slip knot and then we're gonna leave a long tail two two three four five six seven make seven chains and then in the second stitch make spin single crochet and then you make five more single crochet two three four five six oh so we just make six single crochet not five so let's make four of the legs and the arms so the provision to attach this is both a side like this and I forget to record this part so you can uh, like sew it in, sew it in or like do three times knot for the skin and I'll turn it to the hair on you want to cut a bunch of yarn like this it's around 15 or 20 centimeter it's around maybe six inches so we attach at the head of the this monster and you can uh, insert your hook to both sides like both chains here and just pull it So just make it equal to both sides and then you just keep doing this and the head will close. I think you should make the hair thicker like do three yarn at the same time. And this is how the hair looks. At the time I add more yarn in each stitches. Okay, now just style what you want. I got my hair like four hair tie, elastic hair tie. And I want to do it like ponytail. So I separate it in two and tie it. Or you can braid it or make any funny hairstyle that you want. This is just how I want. And then when you finish, you can stream the hair later or just leave it long like that. It depends on you. So here, let's attach the eye. Um, so this pair of eyes is around um, 0 0.8 millimeters. So I'm gonna use this uh, like glue for it's like the fabric glue. It's attached really well, so you can position the eyes ever wherever you want. So the eyes is done, and let's gonna show how to use it. Okay, just basic, basic. Sorry, basically just put your air pot in and close the mouth. So it's only keep. It can keep your airpod from stretching and it looks really funny. You can see that the legs like is dancing. I can make and the hole you can plug uh, like for the plug for the battery that you don't need to pull the airpod out like this. So I own, I've made more version. This is the AirPod 3 and AirPod Pro. I hope that you like my tutorial. Please like and subscribe. Thank you so much. Bye.